What's up guys, Dean here. So I recorded a video on this camera last week. Unfortunately, I had the ISO for some reason, usually it's on auto. I had it set something ridiculous. So the footage I got, I might, if I still have it, I'll put someone's screen right now. It was bad. Um, and what I actually did in that video, I unboxed all of these different pop vinyls that I have been, you know, collecting over the years. I don't know why I said years, it's been like a week or two. Um, but yeah, I couldn't use the footage that I got from that. But what I did what work out from doing that was a cool little setup. And I'm gonna show you kind of my setup of how I record now. Um, and just kind of the camera I use, which is this one, the uh, Sony A5100. Um, and kind of just a bit of behind the scenes of how I've set everything up. So that's, it's gonna be very vlog style, very, you know, just me playing around with this camera, more, making some content for you guys. So, um, yeah, let's, let's go see that. So first things first, obviously this is the camera that I use to record as my main camera now. And it goes into this tripod and this tripod is actually pretty, uh, it has a lot going on. So let's, let's look at what I've kind of set up here. So this is my man Frotto tripod. I call it man Frodo. It reminds me of, uh, Frono's photo. I don't know. Anyway. This tripod, um, it's really sturdy, it's really good, really lightweight. It has a ball mount on top. It doesn't have a quick release or anything like that. Um, I'm trying to get, I've turned around just so the uh, the lights come from behind me. But um, yeah, it doesn't have a quick release or anything like that. But what I've basically done is on top of the ball mount, I've attached this kind of screwed on plate. Now that plate can basically hold two different mounts, two, two different uh, attachments right there so on one side i have something pretty different going on so what i basically done is if i turn this around i basically have the clip for what you would use to uh put your ca your uh, phone onto a tripod and inside of that i have this kind of this plastic ring which is shaped like a phone which is you know clipped inside now inside of that i have my zoom h1 Right there, and that is uh, the input of my Rode mic is going into my Zoom H1. So this is actually recording my audio for this camera usually when I, you know, do a more sit down kind of uh, video. Now my Zoom, uh, sorry, now my Rode video mic uh, Go is just literally taped to this thing because there was no way of actually attaching it properly. Um, this masking tape has been working wonders. Obviously, you can see it working everywhere on these new hex run even on the back you can see it uh but i have done some cool stuff where i've cut it out so when i want to get like change the battery and stuff i don't need to untape anything like this battery it doesn't look like it but it can actually come out pretty easily like that and then you just kind of a uh, slide it back in and that's actually in the panasonic any loop battery so they're uh replaceable just over here i do have the um the full power pack so uh, these two actually charge, one's dead. I probably should be plugging this in, but anyway, that's not what this video is all about. So then this mount here is where I put this camera that I'm recording with. Uh, so what I'm basically looking at when I'm sitting at my desk, uh, like on my unboxing chair, is this whole setup. I have the road mic facing straight towards me. Um, and then I have basically a micro USB card that comes out of the, uh, the Zoom H1. And then I have a normal, uh, SD card that comes out of this camera and I just got to sync them up in post-production uh, on my PC, which is right here. Then I thought to myself, it might be pretty cool if I have a secondary camera because I've done it before in a few videos and I kind of like the look, especially with something like uh, pop vinyls can get a nice close-up of them. So what I've actually done here on my uh, desk is I have hooked up or kind of half attached my Panasonic, my old camera, this used to be my main camera. I do not use it as my main camera anymore because it uh, it has a very small field of view, which was not good for my video. So basically, if I was as far as away from the camera as I am with the uh, Sony, I would only be seeing like that much. So the Sony does an amazing job with a uh, field of view. And yeah, so this is basically stuck, or kind of stuck, that you can still move it around and whatnot. But this is basically my secondary camera for my videos, sitting like that. Um, and then again, I'm gonna put, like I put this camera here, and what you basically would be seeing would be something like that with me sitting kind of where K2SO is right now. 
um, in my chair. In terms of lighting, I do have a lighting kit, which is somewhere in here. I don't even know what I've done. Oh, it's right there. So I bought this light off eBay, which I, I, I did my best with to try and like make it uh, as usable as possible. Unfortunately, it's just not a very good light. It sucks up batteries like no tomorrow. And you can put like a Sony battery into here. Um, which now that I think about it, I have a Sony camera now, but I need to get the batteries for it. Um, it's just, it's not worth it. What I've basically been doing is using as much natural light as possible. Um, and filming any, well, I filmed the one video. I, I'm talking like I've been doing this for years with this camera. The one video was filmed with uh, natural lighting because it, it works. Natural lighting is the best form of lighting, in my opinion, for video and for photo. Um, but yeah, that's just kind of my little update on how I'm recording stuff. Burnout Paradise, my first of a time playing Burnout Paradise. Um, and I'm really loving it. I currently only have 12 more trophies to go to make sure like making lists and stuff so I can get them done. Um, I, I'm almost there. I, you know what, let's do something right now. Let's challenge myself to knock off two things off this list within the next hour. Let's see if I can do it, guys. Are you ready? I'll, be, I'll get back to you when I'm done with this. So let's see if I can knock two things off that list within the next hour. Let's do this. One hour later. So at 12.55, I set out to tick off two things on this list. I've ticked off, let me, I've ticked off three things and I'm on to my fourth as we speak. I'm actually playing right now. I'm doing a, uh, what are they called? A free burn challenge? I'm doing a free burn challenge. I'm actually helping out other players online. So I'm actually host of this server and because of that, I'm actually helping everyone out here. Uh, this challenge right here is a free burn challenge and it's to get everyone into the baseball stadium. Now, I didn't actually know this was a free burn challenge. I did this on another server because this is a trophy for people keep like, lock me out of here. Uh, I did this without a challenge on another server with a bunch of people. It's where you're gonna get all eight people into this arena and you actually get a, get a uh, trophy. I already have the trophy. Someone else asked me to do this for them. Um, of course, I'm, you know, I'm willing to help them out. If they try to get a trophy, I'm trying to get a trophy. Uh, I'm actually going for the, oh my God. I'm just gonna hold my controller. I'm going for the uh, 10 free burn challenges trophy, uh, which basically is doing 10 of these challenges. I think this is number six for me. So I'm getting there, uh, I'm getting there. Uh, there's a couple of people who really aren't I mean, near where we would need to be right now. Uh, zoom out. Oh, they're really not. I don't know what they're doing. Uh, so the trophies I have left now in uh, Burnout Paradise are getting the Platinum Trophy, getting my A license, getting my Burnout license, doing five burning routes, which I don't know what they are, so I have to look it up. Um, I have to shut down the Carson Inferno van, which I think is like the last van to really get in the game, the last vehicle. Um, find every car park in Paradise City and go 750 miles. Now, I don't know, let's take a photo of me. Um, I'm gonna quickly check here how many miles I have gone so far, and it is 489. When I started today, playing today, I had 424. So. That's gonna be a hard one. And also roadway, road rage, or do a road rage challenge with the Carson Inferno. But guys, that shouldn't be too hard. I'm about to start cooking. Just to put some water in a container. Um, I gotta feed my dogs before I start feeding myself because you know, my priority is actually set right in this circumstance. Jesus. My uh, washing machine's on. I was like, what's that sound? Um, so tonight, that's not my chum. My parents are out at Bruno Mars. They got some tickets to it, which is pretty cool. Um, no one invited me, but that's fine. I'm just kidding. They only had two tickets. Um, so what I'm doing right now, again, I'm gonna feed the dogs. Gonna make myself dinner. Gonna put on some football to watch, some rugby leagues in a row. 
Um, and for dinner, I have HelloFresh. I know you guys probably know what HelloFresh is by now. Oh, 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 yes, get him. Get him, boy. No, you, oh, that's a try. That's good. That's miraculous. That's that? His left hand coming off the bottom of the ball. That's a try. He's Check out this. So I'm putting on uh, the Bulldogs versus the Penrith Panthers. I'm actually, Bulldogs is pretty much my team, uh, but I haven't been choosing them for any tipping. But um, I've chosen this week, and I think, and the game only just started, like five, ten minutes ago, I believe. I'll check when it uh, changes screens here. Let's see. Hey, cool. Um, I don't know how far we're into it. Oh, 22 minutes. Wow, they are 14 to nil. Wow, let me check. I'm gonna check something right now. Some real talk. My footy tips. So, ESPN footy tips is who I use after my competition with my work. Let's see who chose. Okay, we have a lot of Bulldog supporters. Uh, one, two, three, four. Really four people chose. Penrith, but um, yeah, I think Bulldogs have this one. Anyway, leave it for my dogs. I'm gonna make HelloFresh, as I said. Uh, I have a steak meal, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna turn that into a steak sandwich just to have something a little bit different because I've had the steak before and it's good enough, but I want to try something a little bit different. So, um, is he gonna get the kick? Is he gonna get the kick? Let's see, does he get the kick? This guy takes a long time to kick. What's he doing? Is he gonna get it? Uh, oh. Who's hungry? Come on. Hello, hello. Oh, my camera, I forgot you were on. I got myself some nice uh, drink to have while I make my meal. Just the right one. Yes, it is. I'm a, <laughs> I'm a little bit teary from the onion, but um, update on the score: Canterbury Bulldogs 18, about to go for two more points. Penrith six. They did score a try. So back over here, I basically done most things. I realized after I cut the potatoes and I moved them to the paper towel, I cut way too much potato. Anyway, I got my potatoes, my green beans, my onion. What was left of the oregano? I may go into my fridge and see if I can get more oregano. Did he get the kick? Yeah, he got it. Um, because that's really not much oregano. There wasn't much on it that I could actually eat off it. It was kind of dying. So I'm gonna start cooking everything up now because it's time to cook it all. And um, yeah, I'll probably show you the finished product from now because yeah, it's, it's just time to cook. So My dogs are literally doing the exact same thing. That is so cute. Anyway, update on the score. Canterbury 20, pen of 12, they scored again. Can I just say that these green beans and potatoes look delicious. All right, so this is what I made. So I have steak, a little bit of lettuce I got from the fridge, the onions on there, some feta. Then with the potatoes, I added some more onion on top of the potatoes because I had too much onion. Um, and added some fat on top of the potato and the beans. Score is still 20 to 12. I'm gonna go eat this. I'll, I'll, I'll sit down here and then I'll tell you how it was right after I eat it. And the fan's on because I kind of made it very smoky in here when I cooked the steak. 12 seconds later. I gotta turn this fan off. There's no smoke in here. Guys, dinner's done. Um, my thoughts on it? My own version of a steak sandwich it was pretty good. The steak could have been cooked a little bit more. Um, and maybe even like tenderized a bit before I actually... Ooh, coming back. Um, before it actually cooked, I could have tenderized it, tenderized it just so um, it was a bit more easy to pull when I was eating it. Score is still 20 to 12, um, 12 minutes to go. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna relax, watch the rest of this game, then go clean the kitchen, clean all the dishes I use. And then the night is, um, all up to me to do whatever I really want to, which is cool. So, yeah, just a bit of a, you know, 
a home vlog kind of video today. Hope you guys don't mind. Just me testing my camera, the microphone. I have to do a lot of post processing to the microphone. So I'm gonna look online now if there's a way to change it in camera settings because yeah, the, the microphone isn't the best right now. Um, but we'll see what I can do. Oh yeah. Just. All right, so I don't remember what the last thing I recorded was. Hey girls, hello. Well, the dogs always like put their hands up on the door when I walk past, when someone walk, walk up to them or near them or into a room where they can see them. Um, so basically, <laughs> oh God, my throat, I got something like phlegm build up. So um, every time I talk, it's either really clear or it is like how it is now where it's like not very clear. Anyway, I don't know if this video is gonna be just what I've recorded tonight or if I added what I recorded this morning because I recorded basically kind of two vlogs in one day. I'm gonna try to combine them as well as I can, but we'll see what happens. Um, guys, if you enjoyed this video though, don't forget to hit the thumbs up button down below. It helps me out know that uh, you're really enjoying my content. And now these dogs are like, I'm not sure how well you can see them. How needy are they? Hey, what are you doing? If they want to come in, I have to bring them in for a bit. But guys, again, that's it for today's video. Uh, leave a comment down below. Something. Um, let me know actually how the audio sounds because I'm going to probably tweak it in Premiere to make it sound better and more like it, it does because it sounds a bit like, I don't know, like... I think it hits the highs too easily. I can see if there's a setting for that. Again, I've been trying. Um, yeah, I feel like it hits the highs too easily, but I'm gonna play around with it in Premiere. Let me know how it sounds in the comment section below. And be sure to subscribe and hit that bell icon. It lets you know when I bring out new videos. I'm actually gonna make a new on-screen, which you would have just seen. Think for the bell icon, icon because the one I have now, eh, it's okay, but it's nothing special. But um, anyway, guys, again, I hope you enjoy the video and I'll catch you in the next one, which I really have no idea what it's going to be. So I'm coming. I'm coming. Peace.